I remember his first practice with Celtics, I thought, well, I'm going to kill this guy today. But he came in late, went there about the first two or three times, he blocked my shot, and I thought, you know, we're going to give this guy a little bit more respect. I mean, it, he actually blocked my shot the first two times I went in there, and I thought, boy, this guy can play defense. Well, come to find out, he's a great defensive player, but he's a heck of a lot better scorer. He's the type of guy that you find yourself watching him. You know, what is he going to do next? You know, because he, like I said, he, he had so many moves around the basket. And then you got to realize Kevin McHale didn't believe in passing the ball back out once he got it. So he doing these unbelievable moves over two and three people. I don't think you can sum up uh, in any amount of time what it's like being a Celtic. I suppose just an immense pride, uh, willingness to do whatever it takes to win, playing hurt, playing when you didn't feel like it, and playing for the best organization that there's ever been. I mean, it's just uh, uh, Larry said it best. I think he said if you didn't play for the Celtics, I'm not sure you ever played basketball.